Today we're gonna be taking apart Alienware M15. Looks like the laptop was previously opened as it has only three screws and bottom case came off super easy and quick. I didn't even use a pry tool. First thing first, I'll be disconnecting the battery from the motherboard and pulling four Phillips screws and remove the battery. Looks like the battery is an aftermarket version. I would always suggest to use the original, just it will hold the power for much longer time. Uh, here is a 2.5 SATA Kitty for uh, either for hard drive or SSD drive. There are two removable slots for memory RAM and by pulling one screw, you would be able to remove SSD drive. Now I will move forward to Deattach the cooling heatsink and cooling fans. It was kind of pain in the ass because the thermal pads and thermal paste uh, got dry and pulling it was super difficult and I didn't want to overforce it otherwise I could uh, damage the pipes and then I would have to replace the whole assembly. Always reapply thermal paste and thermal pads uh, whenever you're replacing or just cleaning your heatsink. Uh, now I will be pulling my Wi-Fi card. This again is just one screw and I will begin process of removing the motherboard. There are multiple uh, rebound cables uh, around the board and there are few uh, Phillips screws that I need to pull. Uh, on the left side of the motherboard you would be able to see yellow CMOS battery if in case you need to replace it. Here is a GPU, a CPU processor and looks like on one side all the ports are attached. On the other part there is a daughter board which can be easily replaced or removed. Here is a DC jack and now that the data board if in case you need to replace it. And last but not least, and it was fairly easy, there are only two screws which are holding the hinges. I will be deattaching the palm rest from the LCD screen. Here it is. Looks kind of filthy, but we will do some cleaning on it. And here is the LCD screen. Always suggest to replace the complete assembly. Peace. 